Pushy Place here, and welcome back to Pokemon Heart Gold and Pokemon Soul Silver. Last time we arrived in Violet City, and we've uh, explored the city, seen all that uh, it really had to offer, which wasn't a whole lot aside from the um, there was in one in-game trade, a the Pokemon School, which we talked about the status conditions in this game. Uh, we got ourselves a new team member in the form of Mareep, and took on the Belt Sprout Tower and the gym itself. And we won ourselves a Zephyr Badge. This time, we're gonna go pick up the egg that uh, Professor Elm has told us that um, an aide was here waiting for us. Long time no see, Gold. I've been waiting for you. This is from Professor Elm. The thing is, we would like you to take care of an egg. Oh, and it's not, it's not the same egg. It's eh, just one egg. I have no idea what they were talking about. But after a while, Professor Elm suddenly cried out, I can't think of anyone more suited than gold. Then he insisted that I hand this egg to you. That's how I came here to deliver the egg to you. It seems that a Pokemon will hatch from it only when you keep it in your party if of Pokemon. That's another reason we've chosen you, gold. Please take care of it. And I'm gonna actually take a look at the items. Uh, Pokeballs. Potions, super potions, which are new. Um, repels, I might actually grab a couple of those. Uh, I'm just gonna go with five for now. Uh, I don't need burn heals or, or anything like that. I think I'm gonna go with just two super potions because the potions are working really well for me right now. Um, I'll get... Uh, I guess I'll get six for an even ten. I think that should do it for now on that. Uh, what do you have? Tunnel mail, heel ball, and net balls. Uh, none of which I'm gonna be wanting at this moment. So let's leave. <laughs> oh, hello. Me, oh my, that egg must be... I see. So it was handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, then from Professor Elm to you. Now I get it. That egg is truly an important egg. Please do take care of it for me. Is that understood? I'm counting on you. Huh. Okay. We will, uh, take good care of the egg like she, uh, like she asked. Um... We could go in, uh, to the Ruins of Alf, but I'm actually going to wait until we get a little bit further into the game because there's not really much we can do at the Ruins of Alf at this moment. Uh, if you try to leave without grabbing the egg from the uh, from the guy in the Pokemart, he will also he will stop you again and tell you, "Hey, there's someone waiting for you." But now that we've got the egg, he will not stop us. Well, wait up! What's the hurry? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. It increases the power of Grass-type moves. Ah, that's not really gonna help me much, because I'm not gonna have a Grass-type on my team. Uh, but there is actually two Pokemon I'd like to catch before we continue onward. If I could find them real quick. Please. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> One is a temporary team member, which I already mentioned, was Bellsprout. Ah, uh, of course we're starting things off with a miss. <laughs> it's as they say, a hit or a miss. Yeah, so I want to catch um, Bellsprout for Flash and another hidden machine. Uh, a little further down the road. Whoop. That'll work. And then there's a Pokemon I'd actually like to catch for the team while we're here. Nope, not potions. Not potions! <laughs> Pokeballs! One, two, three. Heck yeah! And we got Bellsprout! Which is just going to be a temporary team member. 
the flower Pokemon. It, it plants its feet deep underground to replenish water. It can't escape its enemy while it's rooted. Oh, that sounds terrible. And terrifying. Okay, let's see if we can find the other Pokemon that I'm looking for. No. I could defeat it for that for that last little bit of EXP. Uh, but I'm actually gonna wait on that. Because there's a trainer right here that I could fight. No. Where is it? No. It's not Ekans, I swear. Come on. One more encounter and I'll just skip to when, when I find it. Okay, that's not it. <laughs> okay, I'll just um skip ahead to when I find it. Finally! <clears throat> so I had to go and change the clock because apparently this thing has a very, very low encounter rate in the morning slash daytime. Oh, so now it is nighttime in game. Uh, please don't kill it. This took me like 15 minutes to find off, off screen. So I had to look up its encounter rate. <laughs> And then I found out it's found more often at night, so I had to change it to night. And of course that didn't catch. But yes, Wooper is the, the third member of the team that I want to catch. Uh, that's not good. Not good. It's not good. Oh, and I want to make sure it has um, the ability I want because it has two abilities. It has Damp and it has Water Absorb. The ability I want is Water Absorb. Please let this one have Water Absorb because I do not want to keep having to look for another one. What do we got? When it walks around on the ground, it coats its body with a slimy, poisonous film. Ew. Gross. Uh, just like with Mareep, I'm actually going to allow you guys to name him. So I'm not going to name him. Oh, uh, please be the, na the the ability I want. Yes, water absorb! And let's see, you have a sassy nature. Ooh, a sassy boy. <clears throat> let's see, so that's special defense first for speed. Hmm, interesting. Um, oh, I did battle this trainer right over here off screen. Uh, <laughs> so I'm gonna run back to the Pokemon Center real fast. I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's continue onward. Uh, I battled him off screen and Solaris grew a, uh, got the level because of that. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna grab this. Ooh, Repel. I'll take it. That will, uh, replace the one that I just used. I would like to fight this trainer so Wooper can get a little bit of EXP. Not you. Actually, you can go to the bottom of the party because I'm not using you at all. Hi. Wooper is coming along happily. Oh, it's so cute. Anyways, let's battle this trainer. Let's let Wooper have his first battle. Uh-huh, yeah, and you know, Pardon? Pokemon battle? I'm on the phone. Oh, alright. I'll accept your challenge. <laughs> I love how some of these NPC um, trainers have interesting dialogue. Oh, you have nothing good. Uh, the last one I had in my test playthrough um, actually had... Um, uh, what's the word? What's the word I'm thinking of? Um, uh, mud shot. Or, no. No. I don't 
think so. I could be I could be remembering this wrong. Ooh, first instance of burn. Ha. Nice. And Wooper gets a uh, 49 EXP. Fortunately, Wooper doesn't really get to battle yet because it's so low. Oh, you're on a big journey to see the sights? Neat. Let's be friends. Um, okay. Fine. Anyways, let's continue onward. There's so many trainers to fight, grass to go through, and my repel just wore off. So I'm gonna take the bottom path first. Hopefully I don't run into anything. Ah! Um, they don't really have anything. Ah. Uh, Ex I mean, they're not really gonna give much EXP. Ooh, there's an item up there that I'd like to grab. And another trainer I'd like to fight. No, go away, Ekans. Go away. I'm not fighting you. I didn't even grab the item. Let's put another repel up. I got five of them, so let's do it. What? What's higher level than Wooper? Ah, same level. Not okay. I'm gonna put Solaris back up in the back up in the front. No. Ah. Well, I don't have a choice now. <laughs> Oops. And we got the TM for Bullet Seed. Uh, not really necessary for my team because, uh, like I said, I'm not having a grass type on my team. Make room to turn around because there's actually a Pokemon Center right here. And uh, that man over there, if you talk to him, he'll try to sell you a, um, a slow poke tail for like, <clears throat> I think it's like a million poke dollars. And this dude here will give you the old rod for free. Yes, I know how to fish in this game. I know how to fish, I swear. So let's heal up. Yes, if, uh... If your Pokemon in the in the first slot uh, faints, and you go to a Pokemon Center, this will happen. <clears throat> so I'm actually gonna go fight those trainers off screen because I want Wooper to get some EXP. Why are you poking at the ground? Am I really that boring? I guess so. So I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. Um, uh, Wooper did get a level up from those two trainers. Um, but other than that, nothing really exciting. <laughs> uh, Mareep or Solaris did not get uh, any levels yet. That badge, it's from Violet City. You beat Faulkner? Oh, I forgot you were a trainer. I decided not to show that battle because really it was just a uh, bunch of swapping back and forth with the, um, with Wooper and Mareep. Speaking of Mareep, uh, he actually got another level up. Oh, the Geodude in the corner. Cute. Um, there's actually another Pokemon I'd like to catch while we're here. Um, and this will be the fourth member. No, it's not Onyx. Actually, that could be good EXP. Interesting. Oh, critical hit. No. All right. But no, Onyx is not the Pokemon I want to catch for the team. 
It is another common Pokemon here in the caves, but it's not Onyx. And X attack. Same thing as X accuracy. Uh, except that it raises your attack power for until the Pokemon is withdrawn. And there's light. A cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. All he had was a Vulpix. Let's see what's down here. Maybe we'll find the Pokemon we're looking for down here. An X speed. Raises your speed until the Pokemon's called back from battle. Or until the battle ends. TM Rock and 39 Rock 2. Um, I don't plan on using it. It's got like, let's see, it's... You can take a look at it, actually. Yeah, it's 80 accuracy and 50 power. Uh, I don't even think my any of my Pokemon can learn it. We're about to find out. Yeah, no, none of my Pokemon can even learn it. So that's not really something I will use. Uh, as we're exploring Union Cave and looking for the Pokemon we're looking for... No! Let me leave! Oh goodness, that was critical. Let me swap. Come on, let me leave! <laughs> let me get out of here! Let me out of here! There's an item up here. Okay. Alright. Hopefully we can find the Pokemon we are looking for. Yes, but I want a male one because I have a name for it. Come on, no, let me leave. I'm a level above you. Let me leave. Yes, I do want a Zubat for the team, but I want a male one because I have a name for it. No, I don't want a Rattata. Let me run away. I am two levels above you. Thank you. Zubat, come back. No! I'm two levels above you. Why can I not run away? You know what? I'm gonna swap. Come on. Zubat. Please come back. No, Geo Dude. I'll be back when I find a Zubat I want. Finally found one. <clears throat> that took way too long. Why are both of my team members that I want just wanting to avoid me? <laughs> but yes, Zubat is the the next team member for the team. Ugh. Uh, I'm gonna attempt the Pokeball. One, two, three, yeah. All right, we caught ourselves a Zubat. Sure, Zubat can be a little pain to raise sometimes, but I like Zubat and I like its evolutions. Uh, capable of flying safely in dark places, it emits ultrasonic cries to check for any obstacles. Yes, I actually do have a nickname for Zubat, which is the reason why I wanted a male one. Ace! Welcome to the team, Ace. I'm 
gonna go heal up. Okay, now I'm back. And actually, let's put, um, Hooper up in the front. Because I want Wooper to get some more EXP. <laughs> Whoa, what a surprise! I didn't expect to see anyone here. Neither, I guess, did I, but to be fair, you're a hiker. You like to go up in the mountains. Onyx is your one Pokemon, level 11. Ooh, Screech. Harshly fell. Basically, what that means is that it, um, it went down two levels instead of just one. And you're gonna raise your uh, defense by one stage. But that does nothing because uh, Water Gun is a special move. And 253 EXP. Oh boy. Mudshot. That's what I was thinking. I was mistaken. The one that I guess, yeah, the one I didn't have, did not have Mudshot off the bat, but it did learn Mudshot. That's what it was. I don't know what made me think uh, otherwise. No idea. But we're almost out. We're almost to uh, Azalea Town. Uh, Wooper can take these guys down, no problem. Uh, I will be testing out Mudshot soon. I think Mudshot just has a lower accuracy than Water Gun. I think. I don't remember for sure. Uh, Geodude. Yes, Mud Sport. Not really gonna do much for you because I'm not using an, using an electric type at this moment. I'm using a water type. All right, down goes the second Geo, dude. Level ten for Whooper. Slowly catching up to the team, or rather the rest of the team. Uh, and I still gotta level up Ace, which shouldn't be too big of a deal. Uh, that's what switch training's for. Yay! Ha ha ha! Alright, and down goes the last Geodude. 124 EXP. Nice. Oh, oh, oh! Oh yeah! I win! We're almost out of here. Is there anything? Ooh, there is something on the wall. A great ball! Quite great, if you ask me. I'm actually going to avoid this trainer. Because I want to get out of here. Um, I'd like to avoid this trainer. I'll come back and fight them off screen because, uh... Oh, go, go, go. I don't care. I can put up another one. Nope, that's not what I want. <laughs> I'll be coming back to fight them off screen because I just want to get out of here. I just want to get out of this cave. Ooh, is there anything over here? Hidden any hidden any hidden items? No? Okay, fine. And there's a couple of trainers outside that I'll be fighting off screen as well. Oh, and it's raining. Speaking of rain, it's been raining here lately a lot. But to be fair, we need the rain. It's been so dry. And there's two apricorns here. Another one. All right. I want to avoid this trainer, please. Turn around. All right, good. And of course, our repels will. Pro oh, hello. Who are you? You don't know us. We are Team Rocket. What? We broke up a while ago. Give me a break. We have not broken up. Actually, we did once, but we've come back to pr pursue Giovanni's ambition. Enough talking. Shut up and just beat it. Oh, how rude. Don't shove people. That's that's not nice. Nothing is going on. Yeah, right. I saw what you just did. It's unsafe to go in there, so I'm standing guard to make sure people don't wander in. Am I not a good Samaritan? 
No, you're really not if you just shoved a dude out of the way. Anyways, we are here in Azalea Town. Oh, goodness. Uh, we had a lot happen. We, uh, we got the egg from the Professor Elm's aide. Which, actually, what's it at now? Sounds can be heard coming from inside. It will hatch soon. Ooh, interesting. Nice, nice, nice. We got two new team members in the form of Whooper and Ace the Zubat. Uh, next time, we'll be going to check out what's happening over at the Slowpoke Well, as well as explore Azalea Town a little bit. And with that, I will see you all in the next part. Goodbye for now.